Good afternoon. It's the day after Halloween and I thought I might give an update on how things are coming along. It's been a good week. I've been making progress. In fact, today I was able to get up from my chair, wheelchair, and use my walker to take a few steps. did about 25 feet, which um, it's the first day I've done that in a long, long time. And it was great. Um, I didn't want to overdo it because it seems like overexertion has been the most likely cause of the relapses that I've been experiencing over the past seven months. So I might do a little more walking later on this afternoon and certainly tomorrow and every day from here on. Uh, and each day trying to um, progress, go a little bit further, and also start to be able to navigate short steps like a curb. And once I can navigate a reasonable distance and feel comfortable dealing with low obstacles, I will be ready to start using the walker outside. I'm also going to be concentrating much more intensively on balance and adopting the use of a cane because as soon as I can walk reliably using a cane I can go back to work. I don't know how long that's going to take. I'm certainly hoping by the end of the year that looks very attainable. It may be sooner. I hope so. There's just no guarantees but I will be working on that every day. In the meantime, uh, things have been going uh, pretty well in some areas. Kira's going back to work and she has a new job and she really loves it. And so that's, you know, it's wonderful that she's working. It's, it's wonderful that she really likes her job. And she's, you know, finally has a job that uh, uh, she feels good about. And so that's a blessing. In terms of overall finances, I'm sure you can imagine that things are, you know, really quite difficult. I've been in this condition and not able to work for a little over seven months now, uh, getting, uh, you know, seven months. And unfortunately, when you don't work that long, it, 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 it really puts a strain on everything. And so I've been really dependent on the generosity of family friends and good Samaritans and sometimes people I don't even know have contributed mostly through the GoFundMe campaign that uh, our daughter Anissa set up for me. So the appeal continues to please consider getting the word out um, to you all your contacts, uh, sending a personal message above and beyond just copying it out seems to really make it a big difference. So sending a note along with it, uh, asking them to consider, uh, you know, being a good Samaritan, being generous, uh, or spreading the word to their contacts and encouraging them. Um, this will really be a huge help. I've got a couple more months I got to get through. Uh, October was difficult. And so I'm, uh, having to play catch up with that and I'm coming, you know, we're in November now and, you know, uh, November's got a full month's worth of bills coming up that I'm going to have to take care of. So please, uh, if there's anything you can do to spread the word, friends, family, contacts, uh, worthy social organizations like Kiwanis, Rotary, uh, and such religious organizations, that is incredible how much good that can do. And it's unbelievably, um, appreciated and will be appreciated on a permanent basis. So in the meantime, I hope you all are doing great. Uh, can't wait to uh, maybe hear from some of you. Feel free to call me, text me. I really do love to hear from people and uh, catch up on things. And uh, until then, uh, the next time, have a great week and God bless us all. Thank you.